Hey everyone, welcome to Trail Sage, and this week we're talking about broken thumbnail previews. Now, I realize that YouTube tips and tricks aren't really what I cover on this channel normally, but this one really annoyed me, and there's a relatively simple solution, so I thought I'd give it a go. Now, I think we're all familiar with how a thumbnail preview works on YouTube. You search a topic, and if you see a video that's interesting, you may roll over it to see a three-second clip of what that video is about. This also works when you're browsing someone's channel. But have you noticed that some videos no longer have a video preview when you roll over them? I noticed this problem on some of my own videos the other day when I rolled over a thumbnail, and instead of getting a preview, I got a faded play button. And upon further research, I found out that other people are having the same problem. Now, I'm not really sure what causes this or why it only happens to some videos, and in some circumstances, the issue resolved itself, but if the problem persists, the good news is there's an easy fix. First, go to your channel page and click the video tab at the top. This will bring up a gallery view of all your videos. Then hold your mouse over each one and a preview should play. When you find one that doesn't, go ahead and click on that video. After you've clicked the video, you should see an edit video button at the bottom right. Click it and you'll be able to modify your video. From the left hand navigation, choose editor. This will bring up the YouTube video editor where you can make changes to your video. Now select the trim button above your timeline on the left. A blue highlight will appear over your whole timeline. Zoom in all the way using the magnifying icon at the top right of your timeline, and now scroll to the end of your video. Once you're at the end and you're zoomed all the way in, take the blue highlight and drag it two frames to the left. Now I want to take a moment here to be extra clear. You're not looking to shave off seconds off your video, just a couple frames. Pay close attention to the timestamps along the top of your timeline and make sure you're only trimming off a couple frames and not seconds. And that's why it's important to zoom all the way in. Okay, so once you've dragged the blue highlight a couple frames, click Preview from the menu at the bottom. Then click the blue Save button at the top right, and this will prompt the dialog box to open explaining that the original video will still be available to you if you want to recover it. Go ahead and click Save to close the window and initiate the trim. You'll get a message at the bottom confirming that you've made the change and to check back again later. The process usually takes about 20 minutes to an hour to complete depending on how long your video is, but once it's finished, you should just be able to refresh your page and the thumbnail should show a preview again. Now, I do want to note, if you have a longer, heavier 4K video, it could take a little bit longer, but don't worry. Your video will never appear down. It just may take a little bit more time for the rollover to show a preview until the processing is finished. Also, should you need to revert back to the original video, you can do so by going back to the video editor and clicking this three-dot drop-down and selecting Revert to Original. Finally, I know how hard it is to pause a YouTube video while following instructions, so I laid everything out step-by-step -step on my website, trail-sage.com, so look for the link in the description below. Well, that's it. So now that you know how to fix the video preview, here's a pro tip. If you don't already include an ending screen on your videos, you should. And also, hold that screen for 8-9 to nine seconds. Not only is this a good way to put up suggested videos and subscribe buttons, but having extra video at the end will allow you to trim a frame or two off without affecting your content. Well, at this point, I'm sure you've already left to go check your own video content to see if you have any broken thumbnails, but if you're still here, thanks for watching. And if you found this video helpful and you enjoyed it, go ahead and click that like button. And if you want to see more content like this, feel free to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Hey, you're still here. Well, since we're talking about video previews, I know we can't control what YouTube chooses to show as our preview, but there's one video that absolutely kills me. You bust your butt for two weeks shooting and gathering footage, making graphics and scripting out storyboards for, I don't know, let's just say a how to improve your technical running video. And the section that YouTube chose to preview? Yeah, me sitting on the couch with my laptop. Yeah, that's some real technical couch sitting going on right there. Anyway, that's it for my rant. I'll catch y'all next time.